how to embed Instagram feed on website. Now that's what I'm going to show you guys in this pretty quick and easy video. Now this is a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to actually do this. So please follow along and you'll be able to do this as well. And by the way, if this video was helpful, then please do let me know in the comments. Now for this, we're actually going to use ElfSite. Now this website has a lot of different widgets and tools that you can use on basically any website now right over here is the instagram feed now if you click on there this page will pop up and by the way i do have a direct link to this uh, page where you can immediately edit it in the description i also do have a regular link to their website as well but um yeah so once you are here you will have a couple of different options so over here you have the profile widget you have the uh, grid which is pretty similar and then here you have the small widget um, hashtag showcase post slider and the dark profile widget so yeah i am going to use the profile widget and then simply click on continue with this template and then here you can actually add like a source type so public accounts and hashtags my business account or my personal account so if you would like to add any of these two then you also have to connect to instagram if you simply want to use a pub public account then or hashtag by the way then you can simply add, add it right over here so let's say i would add hashtag today then you can see a lot of different posts now this is just a random hashtag for the sake of this tutorial but here you also have a couple of different filters so if you would like to um, filter out certain types of posts you can do that here which is actually really nice and then the sorting you can actually do the publication date or source list option uh, pos uh, position then if you are happy with this simply click on add to website and here you first have to create an elf site account now i already do have one so i'm going to click on continue with google then once you have done that you can still edit it however you would like in here but simply click on the green publish button right over there now once you click on there you will have to select a plan as you can see now um there is a free version as well but this is very limited it's only allowed for one website and blah blah, blah. if you want to be less limited then you can actually yeah choose uh, any of these other plans as well currently at the time of this recording there's also a 30 percent discount if you first choose the light version so the free one and then go to deals right over here you actually have a welcome discount coupon which is available for 24 hours and saves you 20 percent so maybe do that first and then go ahead and choose a different plan and upgrade so it will save 20 percent now i'm simply going to select the light version and then I will here copy the code. Then go to your page and simply um, click on the plus icon, add the HTML, paste it in there, simply click on preview. And uh, there we go. This is now the feed, as you can see, which is really nice. I hope this video helped you out. If it did, let me know in the comments and then I will see you next time.